What's the crack, lads? We are back with our Thursday roundup. We've got the AS Roma big time cards. Now, I know what you're thinking, lads. Did anybody want these? Well, apparently so, because they do have the AS Roma big time cards that they released before. Chris Smalling is back, and you've also got a couple of others that we'll get into here in a second, including a free login bonus for Beckenbauer. We'll talk about that in a second and how you can actually get him. But this trailer, lads, and these trailers, they're basically, you know, it's the same every week now. It's the same every week. Unless they're going to they're gonna bring something brand new. We also have Pellegrini there as well as a CMF. This guy's a good card. Obviously, he's going to be getting the booster uh, and stuff like that as well. But I do feel like at this stage with the game, I mean, are these cards really that exciting? I just feel like that... For now, because everybody has so many good players, like, I just feel like we need brand new legends, like Ronaldo, like Zidane, uh, and cars that haven't come out yet, Iniesta, Kaka, a few of those, right? We also have the J-League, Stoichkov and Kawaguchi, these guys are there as well, and the Italian League Guardians are still ongoing. Now, first things first, right, we have a brand new login campaign. I knew that this was going to be coming um, with the 7th anniversary but obviously, we didn't really know what we were going to be getting. There was rumors it could be a free card. There was rumors it could be a free Ronaldinho. There was another rumor that it was going to be free Messi. But it actually does look like we are going to be getting a couple of things with this, right? So, this 7 mobile anniversary celebration, we're actually going to be getting a free Beckenbauer. But it's going to be a bit of luck to get it, right? So, you can see there that the special login bonus and the campaign objectives. Between the two of those, you were going to be getting, what, 70 plus... Um, spins. So essentially what it means is because the box, and we'll show you that in a second, because the box is going to be a limited time, you will be able to clear that box and get Beckenbauer. Now I know some people that have got it with one spin. The tour event, the challenge event, and the team event, that's the offline events and everything like that. You can just play it with that. So essentially once you complete the campaign objectives and you log in, you're going to be getting the login bonuses there. So it tells you there, right? So log in seven times during each campaign and get up to 21 epic free Beckenbauer chance cards. That will be from the 16th to the 23rd, the 23rd to the 30th, and the 30th to the 6th. That is going to bring us up right up until the 6th of June. So could we see another thing there, like another big update in the 6th of June? I think we'll get it before it, but let's see. That campaign is going to be going ongoing. It's just a login campaign. I reckon we'll get an update maybe next Thursday, but let's see. We also have that special player list and the 7th anniversary mobile celebration as well. Um, so that is what you're going to be getting in that and the special tournament and all these sort of stuff, right? So we'll go through everything. Now, you might have noticed a little Pez 2020 throwback sale pack as well. This is it here. I mean, I don't know how I feel about this, to be honest with you. It is basically 500 coins for 40,000 trainers, three avatars of Messi and an in-game strip called eFootball Rouge. So this is an iconic moment jersey. But what does this actually signal? Well, it signals that we're going to be getting new iconic moments back into the game or else previous iconic moment cards back into the game we'll get into that in just a second but we will have the events here obviously the eFootball league is still ongoing but they have added one or two new events the co-op is back the spanish clubs is there the japanese clubs is there and then of course we have the italian clubs ongoing and then they have the spanish clubs offline they also have this brand new challenge event called flexible so this is an ai event with the option to set the match difficulty to suit your skill level complete challenges to earn not only main rewards but level rewards based on your cho chosen level as well so, I mean, this is something that they probably needed to be doing for a while. But if you look at the difference here again, I just feel like the, the mark has been hit again. Like, it hasn't been hit again, I should say. Beginner, you get 8,000 GP, and Legend, you get 20,000 GP. Um, and you can keep doing that. Obviously, it stacks up. But, yeah, I just feel like that this is definitely not the solution to creating that kind of fair... Uh, offline experience I suppose for people but the beat the clock is back as well in introducing an AI event where you will be aiming to score a goal within the indicated time depending on your record you will be awarded a medal and, re and match uh, rewards now this was something that was quite popular before also it is really easy to, to clear the match pass with this as well um, if you want to do that you get lots of GP and challenge XP and all that sort of stuff you just score the goal the quickest Japanese clubs is still ongoing as well but listen, I know most of you guys will want to be looking at the cards and we're going to get into that and we're going to give you my thoughts. Now, I will be streaming later and we'll give you my full thoughts on that. So with the free Beckenbauer card, right, you will be getting this login bonus. This is just going to be a login bonus of an actual spin. It's not the Beckenbauer card. So people putting up videos saying, oh, free Beckenbauer, I got him in one spin. They have just basically got a bit of luck. 
um, with him. This is the Pez 2020 uh, pack that we already saw there. It's 500 coins. That's what you get in it. I'm going to get into that in a deep dive and what it could mean going forward, but we will show you, right? We kind of know what it's going to mean going forward. I'll get into it in my live stream as well, but we will cover that in depth, right? So this is the Beckenbauer pack here, and as you can see, there's 50 players in this box. So Beckenbauer is going to be either, you know, whatever card that you draw from him. We also have iconic moment players here. So if you go into Davies here, this is the mobile 7th anniversary celebration, but you might recognize from PES 2020, if anybody played PES 2020 or PES 2021, shout out to ye OGs for playing that, you will have this kind of like similar card to the iconic moments that were released before. So the iconic moments were the first introduction to like 100 kind of plus players. Um where there were special editions of the game, right? So you can see there that Davies is there. You also have Rashford and Modric. We'll go into a full review of them. But the prize, the main prize is going to be Beckenbauer. It's Booster Beckenbauer with the plus two in defending. It's a very, very good card. I mean, it's a, it is actually a really good card. And I do feel as a free card. I mean, you, you're talking about having a back line with, you know, Beckenbauer, Rudiger, Costa Corta, like, you've got your back three that are going to be absolutely brilliant if you've been playing this game for a long time as a free-to-play player. He does have a couple of weaknesses. He's not, like, an outright best defender in the game, but he definitely is, for a free player, he definitely is a worthy addition to your squad. The rest of the pack here is kind of, is kind of whatever. So, yeah, if I spin here, depending on my look, I could get Beckenbauer, I could get a special player, or I could just get a, you know, a bad player, right? So we'll just skip on from that. We do get Davies in our first spin. So we're going to be able to throw him in now um, if we want to, but it depends. It's lucky. That pack will disappear when you get rid of that coin or that, uh, that um, spin, and then it'll be come back when you get more spins. The rest of the players that we have here, Chris Smalling, Pellegrini, and Abraham, I will do a full review on those. Uh, I would say that, you know, Smalling's not bad. I mean, he is not bad at all. I mean, with those stats, 28 levels, uh, he has also got shut down and blocker interception. He's got a lot of nice player skills. We'll go into a deep dive on that in a future video. You also have the J-League stars here as well. This is a box of 100, but you only have these two boys in it. Stoichkov, if you got the old booster of Stoichkov, I would say that that's better, um, but this is this is a pretty decent card as well, apart from his speed and acceleration, which just isn't really it for a deep line forward. You also have a goalkeeper, we don't need to get too much into that. The player of the week, as usual, that is what a lot of newcomers usually spin for. You've got Gabriel, you've got Reese James, Rafa Silva, as we thought as well. Isco is there as well. Um, there's a couple of them that, you know, I definitely think would be fairly okay cards. Um, but, you know, they've really started to reduce, and I said this, they've really started to reduce the player of the week overalls and their stats, because I reckon that they are going to overhaul it. But we will do a review on that, I'll have it up quite soon, and then the rest of the cards and stuff we'll be talking about in the stream. But, yeah, look lads, I do feel like that's pretty much everything covered. Um, the Pez 2020 pack is very interesting, the mobile celebration is very, very interesting. They are going to be ongoing with these objectives with the, with the campaign as well, so you've got all freebies in here as well. So it says emerge victorious in a tour event match, score goals in a teamed event, score goals in challenge event, score goals in the eFootball phase, and you'll be getting, every time you complete an objective here, you're getting a free spin. A free spin for what you just saw when I got Alfonso Davies. So you could eventually clear the agent and get Beckenbauer, Rashford, Alfonso Davies and Modric for free. Like, so I do feel that if you are going to be playing the game, you get a bit of luck. You can kind of clear that very, very easily. Um, on the flip side there with the eFootball points, we don't have any on the eFootball points just yet. Um, there's no players there and the strips there is nothing in there except the tree that you already had access to so that is it for me boys we will be back streaming in a little bit and um, we'll be on our main profile and we'll be beasting hopefully um, but let me know what you guys think I will talk to you in a little bit don't forget to subscribe and smash that like button and I'll see you in the live stream in a bit